Why are you beefing? What are you doing? You took my spot! It's 9 in the morning. What's... This is what I do! No need to get violence about this. Put the bat down. You have the right to remain silent. I strongly suggest you take that right. Hola, buenas tardes. Maris Lacey, uh, I, I, I don't speak Mexican. So you have mentioned that you wanted to live in Nanny, is that correct? Yes. Look, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm a little bit nervous about the fact that you don't speak English well. I don't think it will be a problem at all. Where's Sarah? Why are we pulling this guy over? I know a criminal when I see one. I don't know why I'm getting pulled over, Dad. Hey, look, I, I love you. Don't be late. Didn't you just hear me say that I was on my way? You still have a love maturing to do. I'm gonna leave the business to your sister, Veronica. What? The man that you thought was your father, Preston Baker, he was actually your stepfather. I can't believe you kept this from me this long. I'm sorry. God, well. I was trying to send that to you for the past five years. He's coming over. Francisco. No, Mom, he's the biggest dork in school. He has autism, but I don't want you to treat him any differently. Hey, I have an idea. Let's play hide and seek. He's in there. <laughs> I'm so disappointed with both of you. Help me find him right now. Hey, watcher, you're going stupid. Math homework every Monday? That's right, or else. Hey, stop! Boys, this is Sergeant Eva Barreda. I will lose everything, absolutely everything. Angelique Beauty is huge. Now, there's supposed to be a fourth model. Aren't you a little late? Over there. Come on, next to the other models. Let's go. What's going on with this guy? Where is the client? Stop walking. What? Please, please. Don't do that. Wait, Grandma? Is that you? Wait. Stop. Hello, sir. Nice to see you on this lovely, beautiful Saturday morning. I'm your new neighbor, Summer. You live in this neighborhood? Oh, uh, yeah. This neighborhood's going to hell in a handbasket. Excuse me? Yeah, I was just on the phone with Marsha, and I need to talk to Dr. Wilson right now, all right? Now. I'm making a drink. It's 9 a.m. Haven't you had enough to drink tonight? Don't judge. Can you come and help me with these bags? It's... How much did you spend today? And you've been acting very suspicious lately, always on that phone. I, I've spoken to my lawyers. I've decided to make a few changes to the will. I am your wife. So the incident is going to leave me in a wheelchair and you're going to be in a coma. Yes, and, and we're going to take pictures. You're going to ask people for donations. Donna Morris, open the door. It's the police. It's the police. I knew it was a bad idea. Look who's coming. My old friend, Sergeant Jenner. Have you been drinking today? Oh, have fun. You're not gonna let it off the hook, right? Look, you stay out of this, okay? Well, I'm not gonna let you get away with it. If you can't have our backs, then how can other cops have your back? Get with the program, rookie. Hello, Mangrove Park Police. I'm witnessing a guy breaking into a house. Oh my God, officer. <sighs> Thank God you're here. <laughs> That's him. That's the burglar. All right, you stay here out of harm's way, okay? Don't move. Oh. Hands up. You want me to be happy that you got fired I again? get fired. I can't do this anymore. Can't do what? This, us. Just like that? It's, it's over. over. Hey, hon. Hey. Welcome home. So, <sighs> tell me about this intense day of yours. <sighs> what is it? Just tell me already. Yeah, um, I'm pregnant. You gonna go out drinking? Someone coming to me home. I don't know. Hey, don't wait up. Babe, you here? I'm sorry. It's time to move on. You are parked in a handicapped zone. You obviously do not look handicapped. Go ahead. Oh. Call the police. Oh. Okay. You are crazy. You know that, right? I, uh, 
I, I had no idea. Thank you for watching him today. Hi, Grandma. Uh, this is my friend Jason. Hello, Jason. Hi. Nice to meet you. Mm -hmm. You two are classmates together? It's raining, so we can't play outside. What do you want to do? Oh, don't be such a wimp. Give me that ball. I told you it was a bad idea. We're in so much trouble. Robert's here? So, why don't we just get to the case, okay? They're having trouble agreeing on the compensation amount that they're willing to pay us. Seriously? I mean, I lost both my legs here. What are they offering? They're willing to offer 100,000. That's like 50 per leg. Do they know I'll never be able to walk again? Would you two shut up? I can't sleep. It's three in the afternoon, Mrs. Elliott. Let's go. Back up over there. Back up over there. Do you, Do you know, know how much trouble you're in? I'm worried about you, because if you don't pass this final exam, you're not going to be able to graduate. I don't know what to do, Mrs. Dyson. I have no one to help me with my baby. The best thing for you and your baby is to just come back to school and graduate. I have to go. My baby needs me. So it's, it's a date? It's a date. Mom, Dad, this is Kevin. Kevin, these are my parents. You didn't tell us he was black. Where's my watch? I left it on the table. It's worth $5,000. I want to speak to a human, please. Good afternoon. Just one for lunch? Uh, yes, thank you. And how are things going? I mean, the food is great, but uh, I don't see many customers around. It's been a tough year. Thanks a lot, buddy. So what do I have to do? You look sad. What's going on, Mom? Nothing, honey. Everything's going to be OK. You're scamming innocent people. Heather Thompson, it's the police. Open the door. What's going on, my man? Um, how much is the cover charge? Covers 50. Man, you're letting this guy in the club? Come on, man. This isn't Club Cripple. My man, tonight just ain't your night. Remember, never waste any time on anybody that isn't pre-approved. <laughs> no, I didn't think so. Goodbye. Who cares? He probably owns a convenience store in some corner. Oh, God, I'm burning up. I feel so, feel so dizzy. Help! You will learn Sorry. to obey me or else. What are you going to do, officer? Arrest me? That's enough. Come here. What are you doing? Domestic disturbance calls 769 Orange Avenue. Dispatch, this is Sergeant Garrett. Let's just forget this incident ever occurred. Cover for me. People may think that you get away with this kind of stuff and know with me, okay? No with me. I don't have time to deal with this right now, so you make, just make sure you leave this quick and this thing too. What are you doing with all those snacks here in the backyard? Uh, and you like snacks? Don't try to get smart with me, young lady. Tell me what's going on. Nothing. Sophia, tell me what's going on right now. Hello, ladies. Hi. I'm the casting director. I'm Debbie Lynch. Let's go over your lines one more time. Okay. This summer, the only place to be is at the Mango Park Zoo. Can I help you? Sorry, I was just watching. Don't you have some work to do? I mean, I'm sure there's a toilet somewhere that needs to be cleaned. This is clean in my shoulder and my arm. I saw your, your open house signs. There's no way this guy can afford this house. Don't make me call the authorities. What did I do? Call 911. 